Shalom, GMS Daily Scripture, back with the video. I want to give all praises, glory, and the highest honor to Yahweh Bashim Yahushai, the honors to the other apostles, and Shalom to the sincere Akim. Today's video is going to be named Romans 11, chapter 1, and Isaiah 54, verse 7. Romans 11 and 1. I say then, had the Heavenly Father cast away his people, the most I forbid, for I also am an Israelite of the seed of Abraham, of the tribe of Benjamin. So he got people out there, you know, mainly Christians that's, that uh, say, yeah, the Israelites are done away with, they, they died, you know. Just like what they say about the Amalekites, that uh, when the Israelites came out of Egypt, they killed all the Amalekites, but that's not true. The Amalekites are still in the earth. The Israelites are still in the earth, you know. And the Heavenly Father has not cast away His people. So that doesn't mean that the blessing went over all the people, or, or, or like they like to say, the, the Gentiles, the heathens. The Heavenly Father did not do that, you know. He's still dealing with them. He's still dealing with us. He's still dealing with the Israelites, Yasha Allah. So it says, I say then, had the Heavenly Father cast away his people, Yahweh forbid. For I also am an Israelite of the seed of Abraham, of the tribe of Benjamin. That's Paul speaking. So he said, no, I'm also an Israelite. So what you talking about? You know? Isaiah 54. Uh, Verse 7, for a small moment have I forsaken thee, gone, for a small moment have I forsaken thee. This, the, the time that we're living in is a small moment, man. It's not, this is, this is nothing for the Heavenly Father. The scriptures say, uh, one, um, one day with, with the Heavenly Father is like a thousand years for us. So for the Heavenly Father, this, this hasn't been a long time, you know. So it's a small time, and how has he forsaken us? You know, he has put us in slavery by the hand of these so-called white people, these base men. And now, now they are ruling over us. So it says, for a small moment have I forsaken thee, but with great mercies will I gather thee. Come, with great mercies through the uh, uh, blood and through the sacrifice of Yahushai, man. Because by Yahushai, we have mercy uh, from our sins that we have committed. Uh, back in the day, you know, and before we came into this truth. So by by the hand of Yahushai, the Heavenly Father, Yahweh has, has mercy upon us, you know. But with great mercies will I gather thee. In a little wrath, I hid my face from thee for a moment. Yeah, the Heavenly Father was not dealing with this no more, you know. And now he's still dealing, uh, uh, dealing with us through his Son, you know. Uh, but ever uh, it's like in a little wrath, I hid my face from thee. You know, the heavenly father was mad, and and uh, he has all the right to be mad because our our um, people are a rebellious nation. They like to follow other gods, and they like to worship idols. So in a little wrath, the heavenly father hid his face from him, from us. He turned his back towards us because he was like, man. I don't want to deal with these people no more. Put their asses to slavery and put the basis of man above them. In a little red, I hid my face from thee for a moment, for a moment. But with everlasting kindness will I have mercy on thee, said Yahweh, thy Redeemer. Why everlasting kindness when we enter in the kingdom? These two thirds that was the most wicked, wickedest persons, you know, whatever they did. They are going to rule uh, Slakia. They are going to live in the kingdom under the 144,000 elect, you know, mainly Yahweh, Bashim, Shai. And they're still going to rule over those heathens, man. They're still going to be above those heathens. So doesn't that mean that Yahweh, Bashim, Shai has an everlasting kindness, man? If you committed all these foul things, worshipped idols, did voodoo and stuff, and the Heavenly Father still takes you back and, and makes you uh, uh, the top of the earth, the top rulers of the earth, the top nation above all the other nations that were placed upon the planet earth. That's everlasting kindness, man. But for a little while, 
the most that has cast us away and turn his back up uh, uh turn his back to us but that's soon gonna change man we gotta have patience you know the brothers that are in the truth gotta stay strong stay in the spirit man and keep pushing this word man so with that i'm gonna say shalom